Hey guys, it's Regant here, and today I'm gonna show you how to tame this ugly creature, the Roll Red. So let's go! First of all, the taming stats. Um, it's a passive tame, and you can only tame it with giant bee honey. You see the amounts in the box there. It can be carried by a Vyvan, a Katz, and a Rhineer. It spawns on Valguero, Aberration, Genesis, Genesis Part 2, and Fyodor. And the difficulty is 1 out of 5 points. So let's start. So, if you have found a roll red, you have to wait until it borrows. In the meantime, you can take the giant bee honey and put it on the last slot in your inventory and be ready to drop it at any point. As soon as the roll red digs into, her, into its hole, we have to drop the giant bee honey onto its hole. That's, oh, there we go. Just drop it then. And now it could, should, yeah, he ate it, and there you go, taming 66.7%. After that, you have to wait until it digs down again, and then you have to drop another giant bee honey. One important thing, after digging out, the roll red sometimes, uh, are here any crystals? No, the roll red drops some crystals. Never ever pick them up, because otherwise the roll red will get mad at you and wants to kill you and yeah this is not what you should do just leave the crystals lying around and then everything will be fine so there we go just drop again the honey here and there we have our roll red did she dig did it dig out some crystals here no it didn't so i can't show it to you right now so now let's equip it as saddle here and then talk about its abilities. So first of all he has a just normal bite attack here. It can't jump so space nothing happens on space and also on the crouch button. But we have our special skill the right mouse button. This is this here and then you can also jump a little bit. And we can just roll around with the roll red. It's um, it's pretty quick, so it's a pretty fast movement thing, depending on the map you are. But even though, even here, it's pretty quick and it's dealing some damage to dinos you roll over. And as I have mentioned, you can also jump while doing this, and that's yeah, this is just much fun. Um, besides that, there's at least as far as I know no good use case for this guy but it's still fun to use and you see we're dealing some damage and we can just go around like Sonic around the map. So that's already the end of the video I really hope you liked it if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye!